Today, the All Things New restructuring plan went into effect. It is reshaping dozens of Catholic parishes. But some mergers are on pause as the appeal process continues. Our Justina Cornell joins us in studio with more. Justina. Yes, yeah, so right now, seven decrees have been suspended as these parishes appeal to Rome. However, one parishioner tells me he believes there are six more parishes to add to that list. A new sign flashes outside of St. Barnabas welcoming a new parish. It's signaling what could come. August 1st marks the first day of the All Things New restructuring plan. It's reshaping 178 Catholic parishes into 134. We formed about two years ago when All Things New was rolled out. The new changes inspired Jason Bolte to make a new effort. It's called Save Rome of the West. We also deal with helping people write appeals uh, for any de decree that's issued uh, against their parish. Just 24 hours to the transition, the Archdiocese announced the All Things New plan is on pause for seven parishes. When we got the news that there were seven that were being suspended, the ones that we wrote weren't included in that. Bolte believes six additional parishes, including St. Barnabas, aren't on the list. The Archdiocese gave specific instructions to parishioners on the proper steps to appeal. Within a certain time frame, parishioners needed to write to the Archbishop, and then his office would forward those appeals to the Vatican. Bolte decided to bypass. So we went directly to Rome. There's a lack of trust right now because there's a lack of transparency and a lack of communication. We wanted to make sure that all of our points were going to be made, that they would see everything that we've said to them. Now Bolte wants a chance. They could have potentially put their um, petitions in before we did, you know, so they may have, they may be ahead of the game a little bit. That's all we want is the same pause, if you will, so that we can continue to operate as a parish family. Bolte says they're in limbo and as they wait, they pray for a new path forward. We are hoping and praying and we're up here praying on a, on a daily basis, you know, to ask for the Holy Spirit's intercession. The Archdiocese said with these six parishes who went directly to Rome, the Archdiocese will have to wait until they receive notification and direction from the Vatican on next steps. This most likely means this all things new plan will need to continue.